Hello everybody, thank you very much for attending today's session. Show you are still alive and ready to do business with email marketing. I'm Holly Stibben from Smart Messenger. We are a UK based, fully supported email marketing service that costs less than you might think. I just want to start today's session by, thank by thanking ISBA um, for putting on this online summit. I don't know about you, but I am really missing the business events at the moment. So to be able to do something online like this is just wonderful. So thank you very much, Marie and Ruth in particular. So today we are going to look at how we're gonna come out of lockdown as the economy is beginning to reopen and show people that we are still there. Email marketing is a relatively cheap way of getting information in front of your recipients to stay in touch and get noticed. We are online more than ever before at the moment. We've got our phones, we've got our tablets, our laptops, we've even got an office in the kitchen or the bedroom at home at the moment. There are one of two messages that you will want to put across. The first is, we're back, or the second, We've never been away. Whichever one is right for you, it is important to let people know that you are here and you are open for business. Once you've decided which of those two messages is right for you, it is now time to produce some content. So if you can, be helpful. Because by being helpful, you are going to show that you really care about your recipients. Everyone, businesses across the UK, they are all coming out of lockdown. They are all wanting to get business back on track and going again. So if you can be helpful with some advice or tips, or perhaps even offer a training session or a workshop to help them or their staff refresh their skills. You could provide blog posts, videos, updates on your social media channels, but whatever it is, make sure they are really useful, helpful bits of information to help your recipients get going again. And if you can, do provide this information for free or at very low cost. Believe me, people are really going to appreciate that. Only is this kind of content going to stand you in a good light with your recipients. It will also help you to build your reputation. So you may well gain reviews. This may be a traditional review, such as a Google review or a Facebook review, but it could also be a comment on the post. Great article, thank you very much. Really interesting video. I really liked your tips about how to improve my skills. You might also get recommended. So this could be a direct recommendation, for example. Um, I was in an online networking session yesterday and there was a guy on there who's looking for the services that you provide. I'll drop him a line and let him know that you're there. It might also be that they're not recommending your services as such, but recommending your content. Listen to this video yesterday. Go and have a listen for yourself. It's really helped me. You can also gather a following. If you're producing good content, people are likely to want to follow your social media accounts and also sign up to your email marketing lists. So where does email come in? Well, an email allows you to round up all your information in one place. You can send out a business update. Are your offices now open? Are people welcome to come in? You can send a content alert. I've just posted this useful piece of content on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, YouTube, my website, wherever it might be, you can put it in your email. So you've sent your email out to your recipients, your customers, your prospects, your networks, and you've told them all about this fantastic content that you've got to offer. They are now enjoying this content, consuming it, and finding it really useful to improve their business. But don't forget about influencers. Influencers can really make a difference. With the content that you're putting out, if it's good, people such as member organizations, so ISBA, the Chamber, etc., networking groups, if you're part of 4N, BNI, and so on, People, these people will share your content for you and gain you a much wider audience. 
There are also people who are just active, active on social media. They produce their own email newsletters and like to cherry pick content to put in them. You might also include the newspaper. So consider setting up a specific list for influencers so you can email them with your best pieces of content, the pieces of content that you think they are most likely to want to share. After this next slide, there is a top tip from me, so please do stay tuned. Now, before I go, I am going to practice what I preach. Um, I've put together a number of little videos for you. I say little, they're about two or three minutes long, so they don't take up a huge time commitment. And they are packed with hints and tips to help you improve your email marketing. I am also running some training sessions later on in the month, which are all free and you are welcome to attend. Um, if you'd like to follow us, Smart Messenger and me, Holly Stibben, on social media, you'll be able to see new content as I produce it. You can also sign up for our email marketing newsletter, which again, we will be sending out the content as and when it's produced. And also, not forgetting... ISBA, who have put together this fantastic online summit for us, they have also encouraged us to give something as part of the digital swag. Now, we are a um, sponsor of Proudly Norfolk Food and Drink, and they have a new member, Love Bites. They make these absolutely delicious little bites, and I have got a box of them to give away. So go to the ISBA Perks page and have a look to see how to enter, um, or go to our website, smartmessenger.co.uk, and enter there. Well, thank you very much for listening. It's been great to be with you this afternoon. I hope you found that useful. Now, before I go, oh, I said that on the last slide. Well, Here's a little extra, a little extra tip to get you really going with your email marketing. So now, I don't know if you've noticed, but we've all been having a surge of emails at the moment. We're back in business. Don't forget we're here. Come and talk to us. Come and do this. Our email boxes are noisier than ever. There's loads of emails flying about at the moment. So whatever you do when you come to put these emails out to people, this content that people really want to have because it's useful to them, make sure that they open your email. You need to ensure that your friendly from name is the right one. You need to ensure that your subject line grabs their attention, keeps their attention and makes them open up that message. Get your pre-header right. The pre-header is the little piece of text that sits below the subject line. This can make or break your open. Do we need to mention COVID-19? Have a look in your email box. See how many other emails mention COVID-19, lockdown, etc. Perhaps if you use something different, you will gain someone's attention far more than using the words that everybody else is using. I'm Holly Stibben from Smart Messenger. Thank you very much for listening today. I hope you found it useful. Um, as I said, if you'd like more, there's more on our website. There's more on our social media channels. Please connect with me on LinkedIn. I'd love to meet you. Um, and hopefully once all of this is over, we'll be able to meet again at another business event, hopefully in person this time. Thank you very much. Have a great day.